First of all, we will go to GeoGebra.org, the home website of uh, GeoGebra. Then press this. Go to GeoGebra Classic. For this uh, GeoGebra Classic, you can move this coordinate plane as you like. We need to add the image to this uh, GeoGebra. So we press here, go to image, then choose file. Then press OK. Then we need to edit this uh, VATS because now you couldn't see the coordinate plane clearly. Therefore, you will press image first, then go to setting, then press this, change the color opacity from 100, go to 50. Then close this. See, in this way, you could see the coordinate plane clearly. Now, I will move the image. I try to make sure the midline of the vase on the x-axis. After you put uh, the image of a vase in a proper position, we need to choose some points from uh, this curve. So this one means uh, we add the point. When you add the point, try to make sure the center of this point uh, is uh, on the curve uh, of this vase. And uh, I want to find the regression line of a piecewise function from C to G. This is a polynomial pattern. Then from G to K is a, another polynomial. Then from K to L, this is a linear function. Therefore, you will press this uh, input. We will put a fit, then you can choose uh, from uh, all these uh, different uh, function pattern, but I will use uh, fit polynomial. List of uh, points, so I will list uh, from C to D to E to F, to G. You could see the function F of X fit the curve of a vase from C to G perfectly. If it's not that good, you can move any points. Then it will change the function to make it perfect. Now, I know the function f of x, the domain is all real numbers, but I want my function will fit from c to g only. Therefore, I will go to if here. Then they give you choices. I got to use the first one. 
condition that means uh, I need uh, the domain from C to G. So I put the C. Then use uh, less than X. Less than X parentheses. Here's a G. Then I will put the F here because this is a F function. Then I put enter. So they give you G of X. This function, the domain is between C to this uh, G. Now let me move this back. Then I highlight uh, this f of x. So you could see this uh, g function from uh, c to g. Now I want to find uh, another function from uh, g to this k, still polynomial function. So I will add g h. I G K Then I put the enter. So they give you this function. This polynomial function they fit this curve very well. Still, I need uh, the function. Domain is uh, from G to K. So, I will press uh, here, press if. We need an if condition then. the domain from G. to K. So here is the X. Then less than equals to X. Here is K. Then it will be H function here. So I put the H. Then put the enter. They give you different uh, color. Then on highlight this uh, H of uh, X. Now I will find the linear function from uh, K to L. So put the fit. This time I need a line. The point is from K and L. Then enter. Y equals 1.38. Still, I need this I function the domain is from K to L. So I put the if, choose the first one. This is from K. Then less than X, less than X, L here. Then I will put the I function. Then unhighlight this I function. We use this uh, Q of uh, X. After we figure out this uh, 
G function, P function, and a Q function, you will move uh, this. So you could see G function, P function, and a Q function. And also the domain is given so that you can do the integral to figure out the volume and surface area of this uh, vase. Now, I will show you how to put the functions uh, G, P, and uh, Q into 3D. First of all, we go to this uh, view, then highlight this uh, 3D graphs. Then you will get this. First of all, we need to right click and uh, unhighlight this uh, plane. Then we go to setting. So put this uh, setting. Then this one means a uh, 3D graphs. Go to this Z, unhighlight uh, this uh, Z axis, show numbers and uh, selection allowed. Then you could uh, see this. You need to move, and uh, the green one means uh, Y, and uh, the red one means uh, X. So move the green one is a vertical. The X will be the red line. This will be the original coordinate plane. Now I will move this uh, a little bit uh, away and then keep pressing this uh, zoom out. Oh, I just uh, fixed the uh, uh, function Q of uh, X between K to L. Now, I will put a surface using this second one, curve, angle, and a line. Curve from C to G, that's a G function. Angle will be 2 pi. Line will be x axis. Then you put enter. You could say from C to G, this uh, surface. Now I keep doing this uh, surface. This time I use P function. Angle still 2 pi. The line will be x axis. Then I do one more. This will be a Q function. Angle still 2 pi. Line still x axis. Now let's uh, unhighlight this uh, C, D, E, F, G to L and also the A, B.
Now you can move this and、uh, to see these three、uh, D graphs of、uh, this、uh, vase.